Hi everyone, today we're going to study area of a triangle. Let ABC be any triangle whose vertices are point A, X sub 1, Y sub 1, point B, X sub 2, Y sub 2, and point C, X sub 3, Y sub 3. Then the area of triangle ABC is the numerical value of the expression 1 half times the quantity x sub 1 times the group y sub 2 minus y sub 3 plus x sub 2 times the quantity y sub 3 minus y sub 1 plus x sub 3 times the quantity y sub 1 minus y sub 2. Example 1. Find the area of a triangle whose vertices are 1, negative 1, negative 4, 6, and negative 3, negative 5. We have the formula of the area. Let us substitute the corresponding values. So we have 1 half times the quantity 1 times the quantity 6 minus negative 5 plus negative 4 times the quantity negative 5 minus negative 1 plus negative 3 times the quantity negative 1 minus 6. Let us simplify further. 6 minus negative 5 is 11 times 1 that is positive 11. Negative 5 minus negative 1 is negative 4 multiplied by negative 4 it becomes positive 16. Negative 1 minus 6 is negative 7 times negative 3 that is positive 21. The sum 11 plus 16 plus 21 is 48 and 1 half times 48 is 24. So the area is 24 square units. Example 2. Find the area of a triangle formed by the points A, 5, 2, B, 4, 7, and C, 7, negative 4. We have the formula of the area. Let us substitute the corresponding values. So we have 1 half times the quantity, 5 times the quantity 7 minus negative 4, plus 4 times the quantity negative 4 minus 2 plus 7 times the quantity 2 minus 7. Let us simplify further. 7 minus negative 4 is positive 11 times 5 is positive 55. Negative 4 minus 2 is negative 6 times 4 is negative 24. 2 minus 7 is negative 5 times 7 is negative 35. When we simplify 55 minus 24 minus 35, that is negative 4. And 1 half of negative 4 is negative 2. Since area is a measure which cannot be negative, we will take the absolute value of negative 2, that is positive 2. Therefore, the area of the triangle equals 2 square units. Example 3. Find the area of the triangle formed by the points P, negative 1.5, 3, Q, 6, negative 2, and R, negative 3, 4. We have the formula. Let us substitute the corresponding values. We have 1 half times negative 1.5 times the quantity negative 2 minus 4 plus 6 times the quantity 4 minus 3 plus negative 3 times the quantity 3 minus negative 2. When we simplify further, negative 2 minus 4 is negative 6 times negative 1.5, that will be positive 9. So, 
4 minus 3 is 1, times 6, that is positive 6. 3 minus negative 2 is 5, times negative 3, that will be negative 15. 9 plus 6 minus 15 is 0, and 1 half of 0 is 0. So the area is 0 square units. If the area of a triangle is 0 square units, its vertices are collinear. Example 4. Find the value of k if the points a, 2, 3, b, 4, k, and c, 6, negative 3, are collinear. Since the given points are collinear, the area of the triangle formed by them must be 0. So we have this formula. When we substitute the values, the left side or the area is now 0. Then we substitute the corresponding values based on the points. So we have 1 half times the quantity 2 times k minus negative 3 plus 4 times the quantity negative 3 minus 3 plus 6 times the quantity 3 minus k. When we simplify further, this k minus negative 3 is k plus 3 times 2, it becomes 2k plus 6. This negative 3 minus 3 is negative 6 times 4, that becomes negative 24. 6 times 3 minus k is now 18 minus 6k. Let us remove the grouping symbols and we combine like terms. Now, this 2k minus 6k is negative 4k. The 6 minus 24 plus 18 becomes 0. Then 1 half times negative 4k is negative 2k. We divide this equation by negative 2 to get the value of k as 0. Example 5. If A, negative 5, 7, and B, negative 4, negative 5, and C, negative 1, negative 6, and D, 4, 5, are the vertices of a quadrilateral. Find the area of the quadrilateral A, B, C, D. By joining point B to point D, there will be two triangles, a, B, D, and B, C, D. Let's begin with taking the area of triangle A, B, D. Let us substitute the corresponding values to our formula and it becomes like this. 1 half times negative 5 times the quantity negative 5 minus 5 plus negative 4 times the quantity 5 minus 7 plus 4 times the quantity 7 minus negative 5. We simplify further. Negative 5 minus 5 is negative 10. Times negative 5, that will be positive 50. 5 minus 7 is negative 2. Times negative 4, that is now positive 8. 7 minus negative 5, that becomes positive 12. Times 4 is now 48. 50 plus 8 plus 48 is 106, and half of 106 is 53. Therefore, the area of triangle ABD is 53 square units. Let's proceed with the area of triangle BCD. Let us substitute the corresponding values in our formula. So we have now 1 half times the quantity negative 4 times the quantity negative 6 minus 5 plus negative 1 times the quantity 5 minus negative 5 plus 4 times the quantity negative 5 minus negative 6. Then let us simplify further. Negative 6 minus 5 is negative 11 times negative 4 that is positive 44. 5 minus negative 5 is 10 times negative 1, that is negative 10. 
negative 5 minus negative 6, that will be positive 1 times 4, that will be 4. And 1 half of 38 is 19. So the area of triangle BCD is 19 square units. Now for the area of quadrilateral is 53 plus 19 equals 72 square units.